Hello Legion, I know it's been a while since I made a video. Uh, I've been busy, been just doing stuff. But I wanted to make this video to talk about the Hedna crate. Okay, so this crate, I'm gonna fill it up with a bunch of stuff. Uh, nothing like, huh. I guess I have to keep within the limits of what everybody might like because I could put stuff in there that a lot of people would like and a lot of people would hate. So it's kind of like, um, try to get the basic love things. And, um, what I wanted to talk about also is to get this crate. All you have to do is subscribe to this video and I will draw from the people that all subscribed. I will get all your YouTube channel names and I will just draw it out of draw it out of a hat or you know use some kind of app or something and whoever wins I will make a video saying or I'll message you somehow I get a hold of you and and you just give me your email and I'll send it to you and woo. I will be getting a lot of stuff from two of my most favorite comic book places uh, DJ's collectible shop and the collector's choice those two I just love those places so much because one one of the most important things to me about going somewhere is obviously a lot of places like that is not a place for a kid since a lot of the stuff is expensive but a lot once you know when you can't get a babysitter you know you have your kids with you it doesn't say no kids allowed so I take them and the thing is that DJ's collectible shop and collector's choice like literally are the sweetest people ever Ever. I take my kids in there and they are just, they talk with my kids, they just, it, it, it's, they're so kind. I feel so welcome. I don't feel like they're giving me the stink eye, like hurry up and leave, get your kids out of here, <laughs> nothing like that. They're very sweet. My daughter is like very shy. She doesn't like talking to people or, or anything. She likes to keep to herself. And one day, uh, my husband bought her a little frozen mic or a little microphone and she was just singing let it go the whole day and I went into the comic book shop she started just which was the first time she started singing out loud inside the comic book shop and <laughs> and everybody would just giggle and everybody would just laugh everybody was so friendly but <laughs> the owner of the DJ's uh, um, DJ's collectible shop was just like cheering her on and telling her oh, you're sounding great and stuff which motivated her to sing louder and louder and louder it was just so kind it was so sweet and um or, or she you know because fans come come in all ages my kids are fans of dc obviously i don't show them like the hardcore crazy stuff you know but they are fans a lot of the dc and marvel universe and all that stuff they're fans so Taking my kids to the comic book shores, the shop, so they can pick out a comic. That's you know, that's that's what we do with our kids. We take them, we take them out, and they're always with us. And my daughter always wants to buy the Power Rangers cards, the trading cards, and she's and they're always so sweet to her and my son. And my son last time, um, my son. <laughs> well, uh, I'm not gonna get into that, but. My son was throwing a fit because he wanted a Megazord and they were just so patient with us. They were kind. It was awesome. I love it. I mean, those two places, seriously, they won my heart over. And if I have to get anything, they're always helpful. They're always there. Seriously, you guys got to check those two shops out. They are awesome. Back to the hidden crate. Sorry, I got sidetracked. Uh, I'm gonna do a hidden crate like I said all you have to do is be a subscriber and I will draw from there and whoever wins wins this awesome crate that's all you have to do you don't have to like my videos you don't have to comment you just gotta subscribe I guess whatever it, it, it just help um for sure there's gonna be comic books in there I wanted to talk about a little subject that everybody's talking about but I just feel like I just have to say something and it's the whole uh, the back row cover thing seriously that bothered people nobody said anything with all the worship things that's happened that's that's when it's that's when you have to say something 
Like seriously, honestly, honestly believe that. Harley Quinn, Batman, and a freaking well, Deadpool. Honestly believe that the only reason why people even care it at all is because they're a trend. All the little fakes, they want to come out wearing their little shirt, and which is cool, you know, no judging, whatever. I'd prefer you guys be into that stuff than all the other twerking whatever stuff people do nowadays. <laughs> the thing is, when you start trying to stop something that's been happening for, for a long time, when you're trying to change how things have always been, just because it's like uncomfortable to you, that's what I'm gonna say. You know what? I never say nothing. You know, you go back to shopping at Hot Topic. I mean, not that there's anything wrong with shopping at Hot Topic, but the basic stuff. You know, you, you go over there, you wear your little shirts, and, and you call yourself, you know, oh, you know, I'm a Batman fan, even though I don't know anything about him except for what Christian Bell, whatever his name is. Come on. Don't try to cross into this world and then try to change the game that's always been. Because there's been far worse stuff. You want to see messed up comic books, really? You want to see something that's freaking... And it's a cover. I collect comic books called Crossed and Zombie Tramp. A lot of you guys know this. A lot of you guys don't. But I collect these comics. And I'm just... You guys want to see a freaking messed up cover look up a cross cover because seriously what you guys are just bitching about is pissing me off like oh my god like you have no idea it literally pisses me off i gotta say Ooh, i can't show you that one that one's too messed up let's see this is one of my cross comics but really that's that's what you guys are gonna go complain about I have a collection of messed up covers. <laughs> I can't carry the entire box. These are all crossed comic books, along with Zombie Tramp and the little of here and there. Seriously, you're gonna complain about something. <sighs> I just, I really hate uh, the people that feel like women should be more empowered than men. And, and it's just like, really, like, it's a f comic books, games, anime, movies, all that is fantasy based on what some of us wish we were involved in and what kind of life we all wish we would have. Like, it's our escape from reality. But you want to make our fantasy, our, you know, the make-believe, you want to make it all into, a, what, more realistic? Why? The real reality sucks. And you want to take all that away? No. Go away. Go cry somewhere else. Go back to... Justin Bieber, whatever the hell you guys were all into. Literally, just stop, okay? <laughs> sorry, that's my little rant. I'm sorry, you know. I'm not saying that I'm like a 100% big fan of a lot of stuff, but I ain't trying to stop what's been going on for a long time. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying, hey, uh, I don't I feel uncomfortable with this. There's different covers. They make different covers for every comic book. If you don't like that one, then choose the other one, obviously. So thank you guys for watching. That's my rant for today. And uh, subscribe. Kedna Crate. It's going to be cool. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.